A jury has reached a verdict in one of two trials against Roanoke City Councilman Robert Jeffrey Jr. The jury found him guilty of obtaining money by false pretenses from the Economic Development Office for the city of Roanoke. WFXR's Kelsey John Baptiste joins us live from outside of the courthouse tonight. Kelsey, good evening. Good evening to you, Kathleen. It took the jury about 22 minutes to deliver that guilty verdict. Take a listen to this. Unanimously find the defendant, Robert Lee Jeffrey Jr., guilty of obtaining money by false pretenses of more than $1,000 signed the foreperson. During the trial, Robert Jeffrey Jr.'s lawyer, Jonathan Curtin, argument is that Robert Jeffrey never embezzled any money. He claimed that someone else who worked for Robert Jeffrey with a criminal record submitted the forms to get paid. In response, the Commonwealth attorneys asked the jurors to use their common sense after hearing Curtin's closing arguments. They then proceeded to go through Robert Jeffrey's bank statements that showed thousands of dollars being spent in the span of a couple months. Presented false facts. The defendant intended to defraud the EDA, and the defendant, but for the lie that the defendant told on his two applications, would not have received $7,500 times two to equal $15,000. If they can't be straight up with you, how can they be? asking you to convict this man beyond a reasonable doubt. After the conviction, Robert Jeffrey's family had tears falling in their eyes as they saw him walk into the courtroom a free man and leave as a criminal. Now, I did try and ask for comment from both the Commonwealth's attorneys and his lawyer. They both refused. The Commonwealth's attorney did say that they're trying to focus on tomorrow's trial, which focuses on his embezzlement case. That starts tomorrow at 9 a.m. In Roanoke, Kelsey Jean-Baptiste, WFXR News.